the third tutorial in Radford University series on how to use Google Documents. In this tutorial, you will learn how to upload a Microsoft document from your computer and convert it to a PDF file or an Adobe Acrobat file. You'll also learn how to add a hyperlink, which would be a link to an internet page. And you'll also learn how to publish and share this document with others, say, students in your classroom. So to first get started, we will begin here at our Google Docs page. And what we're going to do is upload a file from my computer, a Microsoft Word document, onto Google Docs. To do that, we'll select Upload, which brings us to this new window. Select Browse, and then navigate to what you're looking for. I want Homework Instructions. Open that. I want to give it a name. And then I want to select Upload File. Now, I now have a Google document which came from my home computer. What I need to do next is add a link, a link to an internet page. As you can see, this is homework instructions for tonight's assignment. I'd like to link a website that my students need to read. So in this URL, I'm going to paste, which I've already copied a URL. I'm going to right click, select paste, and there's my URL to my web page. I'm going to give it a title. And then I'm going to give it just a little information here for the flyover. I'll show you how that works. And this is an article on bees. And I do want this to open in a new window. And then I'm going to select insert. Now I have a link to my new page. As you see when I drag my cursor over, it says article on bees. If I select that, it gives me the link, and when I select it, it would open it up in a new window. Okay, what I need to do now is convert this to a PDF file. So in the upper left corner, select File, hover your cursor down to Download File, and then select PDF. Brings up this window where you can open it or you can save it. I want to save it. Select OK. And it's done so, and if I just double click it, I now have a new PDF file that came directly from my Microsoft Word document on my computer. Okay, so I'm going to close all that out, and the last thing we need to do is share this, or publish it. So let's come over here to the right and select Share. As you'll see, I have one option where I can publish this as a web page. What that would do is put it on a blog page or an internet page, something for the whole world to see. What I want to do is share this with others, such as the folks in my classroom. So select Share, brings up a new window. And now I can invite people as collaborators, which is what I'd like to do. I'm going to choose these folks from my contacts. And let's go to the correct folder. We want friends. I'm going to select all, and then select done. And that drags in my email addresses to this box. I don't want these collaborators to invite others, so uncheck that box. Uncheck this box as well because I don't want those invitations to be used by anyone. And now I'm done. And I'm ready to invite them as collaborators. And now I have this new window. I'm going to add a message to these folks. It just says, this is your homework. I'm not going to check these boxes because I don't want this document to be in an email message. And I don't, the CC me is a carbon copy where it would send a, a copy of this email back to me. I, I don't need that. I'm ready to go. I'm going to hit send. And my message has been sent. And this the Google document has now been shared with the folks in my class. In this video, you've learned now how to upload a Microsoft document and convert it to a PDF file. You've also learned how to add a hyperlink or a link to an internet page and how to publish and share this with others. In the next video, you will learn how to create a test or quiz and embed that inside Google Documents. Thank you for watching this video.